the thousand-year frescoes, the Abbey of saint savin sur gartempe The village of saint savin in southwestern France has a population of only 1,000 people, but it's well known for its local church, the Abbey of saint savin sur gartempe The building as it is today dates back to the 11th century. Despite a turbulent history, the church has managed to retain its magnificent ceiling paintings. They're 17 meters above the floor and 42 meters long. The ceiling was painted between the 11th and 12th centuries by several different painters. Some of the frescoes depict scenes from the Old Testament. Paintings in churches played the same role as picture books for the monks and the general public, who at that time were mostly illiterate. Some scenes are from the book of Genesis in the Old Testament. For example, you can see the biblical Tower of Babel. Another Old Testament story, Noah's Ark, is also told in pictures on the abbey ceiling. God instructed Noah to build an ark and put a single pair of each animal on the first and second floor and his family on the third floor so they would all escape the flood sent to cleanse the earth. These frescoes survived over a thousand years thanks to a special painting method. The base layer was made of lime and sand paste the paints were also made from natural materials such as mud and lime. The paint has lasted so long because of the chemical reaction between the paints and the base. It must have been physically demanding for the painters to paint such a large area on a high ceiling where they would have lacked light and strained their necks, looking up constantly. <coughs> People still pray in the abbey, and the 1,000-year-old biblical ceiling paintings still attract the eyes and minds of worshipper and visitor alike.